offshore structures, rig and production platform, are complex facilities to drill wells and or produce gas from wells from offshore locations. This is one of the most fascinating structures in the world, and this video will describe five largest offshore structures on the planet. Five largest offshore structures is as follows. Burkut Platform Pertado Platform Petronius Platform Hibernia Platform Mars B. Olympus Platform Burkut is the world's biggest oil platform, which has begun commercial production at the Sakhalin 1 offshore project in Russia's Far East. The Burkut oil rig is expected to extract 4.5 million tons of oil annually. The Sakhalin 1 consortium formed in 1996 is the first major shelf project in Russia, created under terms of a product sharing agreement. The international consortium is made up of the U.S. major ExxonMobil, Japan's Sodeco, Russia's Rosneft, and India's ONGC Videsh. The Bakup platform is expected to produce 12,000 tons of oil daily, or about 4.5 million tons annually, raising the total output of the Sakhalin 1 consortium to 27,000 tons a day. Perdido is the deepest floating oil platform in the world at a water depth of about 8,000 feet, operated by the Shell Oil Company in the Gulf of Mexico. The Perdido is located in the Perdido Fold Belt, which is a rich discovery of crude oil and natural gas, that lies in water that is nearly 8,000 feet deep. The platform's peak production will be 100,000 barrels of oil equivalent per day. At 267 meters, the Perdido is nearly as tall as the Eiffel Tower. Petronius is a deepwater compliant tower oil platform, operated by Chevron Corporation and Marathon Oil, in the Gulf of Mexico, 210 kilometers southeast of New Orleans, United States. A compliant pile tower design, it is 610 meters high, and was arguably the tallest freestanding structure in the world until surpassed by the Burj Khalifa in 2010, although this claim is disputed since only 75 meters of the platform are above water. The multi-deck topsides are 64 meters, by 33 meters, by 18.3 meters high, and hold 21 well slots, and the entire structure weighs around 43,000 tons. Around 50,000 barrels of oil and 70 million cubic feet of natural gas are extracted daily by the platform. The platform is situated to exploit the Petronius field, discovered in 1995 in Viasca Knoll, Block VK 786, and named after Petronius, the Roman writer. The seabed is 535 meters below the platform. The compliant tower design is more flexible than conventional land structure. The production platform Hibernia is the world's largest oil platform by weight, and consists of a 37,000 tons integrated topsides facility, mounted on a 600,000 tons gravity-based structure. The platform was towed to its final site, and 450,000 tons of solid ballast were added to secure it in place. Inside the gravity-based structure are storage tanks for 1.2 million barrels of crude oil. Facts about Hibernia Hibernia was the world's first iceberg-resistant gravity-based structure and remains Canada's largest offshore platform. The Hibernia platform is able to withstand contact with a 6 million ton iceberg. Robust iceberg management system uses satellite aerial and marine reconnaissance to detect icebergs, and safely alter their trajectory away from the platform. ExxonMobil's advanced oil recovery technology has been used to support both water and gas injection at Hibernia, with the potential to recover as much as 60% of the hydrocarbon resource. Olympus, Mars B development, is owned by Shell. The structure was built in South Korea, and became operational in February 2014. This is Shell's seventh and largest floating deep water platform in the Gulf of Mexico. Combined production from Olympus and Shell's original Mars platform is expected to deliver an estimated resource base of 1 billion barrels of oil equivalent. Olympus is a tension leg platform featuring 24 well slots, a self-containing drilling rig, and capability for subsea type acts. In addition to the Olympus drilling and production platform, 
The Shell Mars B development includes subsea wells at the West Barrias and South Dimos fields, export pipelines, and a shallow water platform, located at West Delta 133, near the Louisiana coast. Using the Olympus platform drilling rig and an additional floating drill rig, development drilling will be able to ramp up to an estimated peak of 100,000 barrel per day. Thanks for watching our video. If you like our video, please subscribe to our channel and like our Facebook fan page.